What's up, YouTube? Um, back here. I got a uh, pretty fucked up, but, but God, dude, it's pretty cold here in Louisville. This guy looks pretty nice, though. But oh shit. But yeah, I, uh, I broke my toe pretty bad. Don't really uh. <laughs> yeah. Don't really want to talk about it. It's kind of embarrassing. But back onto the customs. Well, the blackout customs I've been working on. Shit, bro. I got this flashlight on too, so I probably don't even need to sit out here in the sunlight. Get, uh, all right, I'm gonna set the shoe down here. Got the lace tips painted around. Uh, man, the whole shoe just got painted real nice. Uh, first custom I ever, well, I tried to, to make customs before, but none of them worked at all. But, man, this one did. It's looking nice, but the 12s that are coming out later on this year, I gotta get that extra white paint off, but I'm gonna repaint the Jumpman label right here. I'm gonna paint that white. And I'm gonna re-get these, I'm gonna re-gold these. Make them gold again. And the Jumpman right here, I'm gonna make them white. And the letters that go down through the tongue, I'm gonna make them white. But, other than that, man, I think this is one of the nicest customs I've seen in a while. And I just, this is my first one I ever really done. And I actually got the right paint for it. The other ones I like, I had some beaters and I just spray painted them. People say, oh, what are you customizing your shoes? No, I'm not. I just, I didn't want the shoe no more and I was bored out of my mind, so I spray painted them. It wasn't nothing to do with customizing or nothing. But, here, wait a second. These. I brung them out. When did I bring them out? When did I bring these out? Two days ago? Nice. Nice, nice shoe, man. And just so y'all know. real carbon fiber man wait let me grab a screwdriver this is how you can know if it makes that little that click it's real carbon fiber bro but um and also if it's flat that's how you can notice this has like bubbles and stuff in it it's a real carbon fiber that's how you can tell if your phone posits are real or not man if y'all didn't know Another thing about these shoes, they are, they're made really good, they, I think Nike's stepping up with how they make stuff, cause they used to mess up on that Nike sign a lot on it, but now everything is looking good. Alright, got these two, these two shoes down. Now, just know, I should have did this one. After the 12, I was doing worst to best, but I did my custom first. I was gonna do this one next, and then this one. But I'm about <laughs> my I'm saving my hottest shoe. I'm only showing y'all four shoes a day, but I'm saving that hot shoe for last. It's a really hot shoe too, man. But uh, this is LeBron. It's my official review on this. I like the colorway, me personally, because it's Golden State's colors, but. Other than that, I'm not really a LeBron fan. I don't really support... Well, I mean, I, I support LeBron because, yeah, he is a good basketball player. But I just don't like... I don't like how he flops a lot and he bitches about everything. But other than that, man, he's a good player. But his LeBron 13s, they look pretty ugly. I ain't even going to say nothing. KDs are getting ugly. I think I'm going to stick to my retros and my... Uh, my older LeBrons and my older KDs and my phones, man. That's pretty much what I'm staying to. But, I mean, it's still a really good made shoe. There's nothing wrong with it. It's, it's a nice shoe. Still, 
for some reason, the stuff that this is made out of stays icy longer than stuff that foam posits are made out of, man. It just doesn't stay icy that long. I've worn these maybe like 10 times, I think I've worn them. Yeah. But uh, I stepped on a... Um, can't even... I need to put it back down here. Alright. I don't know if you can see it, but my carbon fiber cracked. Right here, man. Right there. I don't know how or what happened, but... Bro, these shoes are like... So nice. Nicest foams that's came out in a while. Has that little, it actually looks like a fish scale, you know. I mean, it's supposed to, but still, I didn't think they was gonna be able to pull it off like they did. Like, if you put it up in the sun, man, it reflects different colors and everything. It, that right there goes real hard. I like it. Me personally, I think that's <laughs> one of the biggest things that stand out to me on this shoe. bottoms they're like I said pretty yellow but on the sides they're still icy so I ain't complaining I'm gonna get some sea glow anyway so I ain't really worried about it and also that Nike sign right here on the back if you get a fake pair the Nike sign starts about wait where is yeah it starts about right here instead of right here it starts right here and it only goes to right here. It's a smaller Nike sign. It's a real small Nike sign, man. That's how you can know it's fake. And, uh... Let me flip this inside out. This stitching right here... I don't know if you can see that. Oh, I just want to point this out, too. <laughs> uh, there's a little bitty nick in my shoe I got. Straight from, factory, from the factory, man. Well, not really from the factory. I got it from this guy that got it from the factory. Shoe is still perfect condition, man. Straight how it came from the factory. The only thing different is how I laced it. And y'all should know by now, if y'all watch my videos, I like my shoes really loose. <laughs> like, really, really loose. But back to what I was saying about this. If you can see the two stitch lines right here, there's that one, and then there's the one right below it. There's only one stitching line if you got a fake pair. And the Nike sign thing I was telling y'all about. But uh, another thing I noticed... If I tilt the shoe up like this, I don't know if y'all can tell, but right here, they messed up on it a little bit. But I, I ain't complaining, man. It's I think it looks better like that, honestly. But, man, this is a nice shoe. I think this is one of the best colorways that's came out on foams. The green, red, and black with the gum bottoms. I like the gum bottoms. But these right here, how they stand out. Like, out of everyone in the crowd, man, they're going to notice your feet. Like, these things are... I break so many people's necks wearing these. But, yeah. Um, now, out of these four, these are my uh, latest sneaker picks up, pickups. It's my latest custom. I'm going to have to say... That still is my favorite one, man. Still. It's really nice. And that's my second favorite. And then, this is just my hoop and shoe anyway. That's just, you know, and these. Those are nice, man. I just gotta get the re, we'll re gold those out. My lace tips. And they'd be good. But yeah, man, it's been KZ. Had a nice time making this video with you guys. And I'll get back with y'all with another video. Peace.